So Fortnite just nerfed Take the L. Now, if you go to your account settings, you'll see a setting called the confrontational emotes. And by default, it's on friends and party. So basically, now if you get L danced on in a real game by someone that's not your friend, you will not see that emote at all. It will just look like they're standing still on your screen, basically. And if you want to see the L dance from other players, you have to manually turn it to anyone. And Fortnite is so weird for this because they purposely made it default friends only. Because they don't want most people to see Take the L, laugh it up, whip crack, or make it plantain. They essentially just shadow banned all those emotes. Because because most players will never go out of their way to turn that setting to anyone. So for most people, that setting will stay on friends only forever. So they'll probably never see Tate the L or any of those emotes again. I'm not gonna lie, Fortnite is kind of smart for this. They basically removed those emotes without removing them. But like, why though? They're literally emotes in a video game. Fortnite is becoming too family friendly. Like, who's running Epic Games Nick 30 or something, dog? And Tate the L was so easy to counter to. For example, say you just randomly lag out in a game because your internet sucks. Like, dude. And then like 30 seconds, you come back and some kid kills you and starts L dancing on you. And I'm getting L dance. Like, what is this, bro? In this situation, all you gotta do is just add the kid who L danced on you. And they usually accept. Then you simply just 1v1 him and destroy him. Play, please, play. Bro, Dylan's actual. He has like 100k on. And TikTok. Do you wanna run trios? I might have off, but my internet's been so bad. Can you play with us, please? We need to get carried, like... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Dilly, you can't... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> that's literally all you gotta do to counter L dances. Just a 1v1 and destroy him. And if you lose that 1v1, that's your motivation to get better. So in my opinion, this part of the update is a big L. 